very good. Okay, now we move on to this one. Uh, uh, the mini, I, I come again. Uh. Okay, according to this photo, okay, this photo is a summer, right? And summer, right? Take a photo, just a gurun, take a samo, samo, not summer. Okay, jawab soalan, soalan, uh, very good. Answer the following questions. Okay, as you can see from here, this thing, uh, nama kan kawasan yang ditunjukkan dalam foto satu. Okay, if you got this paper already, you just write the answers on this paper. But if you don't have, you just use your essay paper or the exact the, the essay paper. You just write bagian B, you write bagian B, then you write the one question one. Or oh, before that, you must write this. Ah, you write this bab lapan. Okay, bab lapan bahagian B, and you write the soalan satu A. Okay, then you just write the answer. Okay, remember write the date also. Ah. So, how to do the first one? Okay, the first one is very simple. This one we call it as what? Sorry. Okay, this one we call it as what? What? Apakah kawasan? Apakah nama kawasan ini? Very simple, we call it as a kawasan. Kawasan kurun panas. Okay, kawasan kurun panas. That's the thing. Alright, that's the thing. Okay, so B. You have copy first. Ah. B is like this. Senaikan lima kawasan yang mengalami iklim seperti kawasan dalam foto satu. So, in the whole world, which area got this kawasan? Okay, as you can see from here. I show you up here. Ah. Okay. This one, this one, this one. Okay, this is it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, in the whole world, as you can see from here, alright, as you can see from here, we have Gurun Ta, Gurun Arab, Gurun Ilan. Okay, I do Sahara, Sahara. Okay, so you just write the name here. Okay, so you just write the name here. Gurun, ah, uh, Gurun Sahara. Okay, just, just a name only, then you write Gurun. Okay, Guru Iran. Okay, ding ding. Then you write Guru. Okay, and this one you write Guru. Okay. Okay, copy first. Okay, ini ya senang. Menyelesaikan lima kawasan. Five different areas in the whole world that got this iklim. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. And the, uh, 只要好了吗？只要。Teacher two more gem. Oh, two more gem. Oh, yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, thank you. Ah, thank you. Ah, apa lagi? Guru Arab, Iran. Ah, more gem. Sahara, leh. Sahara, dia. Ta, 还没。Okay, ta lah. Guru ta. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Okay. All right. Pass is like this. Okay. Part one sudah siap. You copy first, then pass is like this. Namakan, ah sorry, nyatakan tiga ciri-ciri tumbuh-tumbuhan semerjapi kawasan di atas. So, ciri-ciri of course can withstand the very hot and dry surrounding. So, you can see like this, tahan cuaca panas. Okay, tahan cuaca panas. Then the next one will be like this. Okay, pokok jenis serofit. What is the meaning of the Bokok Janice Jerofi? means can withstand the very hot and dry surrounding. Lah. Then the next one will be the uh, Dumbu Sechal Jang Jerang. means it's still ready. Ready. It's not like everything crowded. Okay, No, it's like very, very far away. The distance is very far away. That's the thing. 
Okay, BFC. Okay, copy first. Huh? They, they, when at night they can go actively. Okay, they can go and grab the food. Right, they can get the food at night. So, mengapa hitupan dia di kawasan dalam foto satu aktif? Why the photo one is very active at night? Because in the morning they want to save their energy. Okay, they want to save their energy. Uh, how do they save their energy? Okay, they can hide inside the under the tree, and they can hide inside the hole. All right, to save the energy. Okay, that's the thing. All right, copy first ah. Uh, okay. Okay, now we look at the next one. Berikan tiga contoh hitupan dia yang terdapat di kawasan dalam foto satu. You just list out three different animal that can be found in this area. So the first one came out lah. Like a lot of Excuse me, the next one will be Kala Jengking. Kala Jengking. And the next one will be what? The next one will be Tikus. What's the Kala Jengking again? Kala Jengking is this animal. Let me show you. This one. Oh, poison one. This one. Okay. Can you see? Uh? Scorpion. Uh? Scorpion. Alright. This one. Okay. So now we are focusing on this two. The part two. The question two is this one. Apakah nama ini? Nama ini kita panggil hutan monsoon tropical. So look at the question B. Namakan satu contoh kawasan hutan dalam foto dua di negeri berikut, negara berikut. Okay, list one contoh, list one contoh kawasan hutan. Okay, kawasan hutan dalam foto two. So as you can refer to the textbook, okay, or you got a nota. Okay, you can see from here. This is a hutan monsoon tropica. Okay, India, we have this place. Myanmar, this one. Thailand, Sri Lanka, Sri Lanka. Lah. Okay, this one, not Sri Lanka, Sri Lanka. So for this one, for the India, we have this place. Uh, one, one location is enough already. The next one, we can say Mandalay. Mandalay. The next one, we can say Thailand here is uh, Nakhon. Okay, Nakhon. Chasima, then the next one will be the Taman Negara. Taman Negara, uh, Yala. Yala. Okay, Sri Lanka. Okay, so this one you copy first, then you copy this one B, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, this one will be your answer. Then the part C here. Okay, the part C here. Namakan empat ciri tumbuh tumbuhan semula jadi. Ah, dalam kawasan hutan tersebut, state four characteristics of the of the plant that can be found in this forest. So the past here, as you can see, okay, tertiri daripada pokok kayu keras. Okay, very hard trees. Okay, seperti jati, cenggau, ah, uh, cendana. Okay, the next characteristic will be like this. Okay, the next characteristic will be like this. The height of the tree, the tinggian. Okay, ketinggian pokok antara 20 hingga 30 meter. Then the part 3 will be, uh, the part 3 will be like this. Daun pokok yang banyak. Okay, daun pokok yang banyak. Okay, dan lebar. Okay, the pok uh, daun pokok yang lebar means a very big size lah. The big area lah of the, of the leaf lah. The leaf is called a big area. Okay, big size. Then the next one, the hujung. Daun yang berbentuk bus. Okay, so this is a four characteristic of the uh, plants that can be found in this hutan. Okay, I think this one got him already. Ah, uh. okay. So next one, still got part D and E only. Okay, we look at the part D here. Berikan tiga ciri hidupan di kawasan hutan tersebut. I repeat, berikan ciri tiga ciri hidupan lia the kawasan hutan tersebut give three different characteristics. So this is a short term compared to the previous question. This one is like this. Okay, because the, the weather there is very hot. Okay, the temperature is there is very hot. So berburu nipis. Then the next one, the animal, the kulit pekatut. 
皱皱皱皱皮了，皱皱了。Okay, then the next one, the size, the size. Okay, very big size. The animal there, you can see a tiger. You can see a tiger is very big size. And this one, uppercut journeys bunga yang unique, ha. Huh? And, and if, if you see the unique word, you can know there's one very very special, very big flower that can be found in that area. Okay, Rafisia curry. I repeat, ah, uh, apakah jenis bunga yang unik boleh ditemui di taman negara Kaosok di Thailand? That's the thing, Rafisia. Okay, got it. So, seven. 